What's going on, guys? Welcome to week four of the BBDL. This week, my opponent is Oatmeal. And yeah, so my opponent does upload all of their battles as well, um, as most of my opponents that I've played in the, the following weeks. So um, I will link their channel down in the description below. So make sure you go and check that out. Um, my opponent this week's got a pretty versatile team in kind of what he can bring. He's got the, um, like, Psy Spam. He's got a Trick Room mode. And then he's also got Dragonite and Champau. So it looks like he kind of brought all of that. Um, so kind of going off what I did last week, I'm going to lead Weezing. Oh, also, I need to put all these down. Uh, so give me just one moment. But I am going to lead Weezing for sure. Oops. Okay, so we're going to lead Weezing. Um, I kind of want to lead Dondozo with Weezing. Landorus wouldn't be a bad lead either. I'll lead with Lando, bring Dondozo in the back, and bring Pessimian. I think this is what I want to do. Yeah, that's what I'm going to go with. We'll see how this game one goes. I didn't bring Tatsugiri this week. Um, just because he does have like two mons on his team that can bring Haze in both Dragonite and Champau. So I didn't want to bring my Dondozo Tatsugiri into that. Um, and I kind of want to see how it would go without the Tatsugiri, so. Let's see what he leads off with. Okay. So that's an interesting lead. Definitely not one I expected. So this is gonna shut off Mind's Eye from, if, I, if I'm remembering correctly, this will shut off Mind's Eye from the Ursa Luna Blood Moon. I think I just kind of want to protect here. I think I'm just cool with protecting and then going for a U-turn. Is that what I want to do? What smells do I have in the back? It might hyper voice. I just don't know what that. What is. I don't know what Exeggutor is going to do. I'm just going to rock slide. And peel it out. We'll see what this Exeggutor is going to do. Let's protect. Does it get Trick Room? Oh, it does get Trick Room. Okay. So he's Trick Room. Interesting. I think it's Harvest. I don't think he had... Um... Don't think he brought... Frisk. Because I think I would have been told if he had brought, in fr brought Frisk. Do I care about... I'd like to try and get a poison off. Honestly. And... Go oh, U-turn. It's terrestrializing. Oh, did I not terrestrialize my wheezing? I meant to terrestrialize my wheezing, if that's not the case. <laughs> that's horrible. Blood Moon Ursaluna. It's Terra Normal, it's kind of figured. Okay, I did Trash Slice. Why can't I find. No oh, there's Terra Normal. Yeah. Probably like Hyper Voice, um, Blood Moon. Break Break, Weakness Policy. Okay. Weakness Policy. Break, break. 
Okay. Hyper voice. I was like, hello. All right, let's see what Pythamian can do with um, Assault Vest. Will I live a plus two? I mean, a Landorus did. Landorus is also significantly bulkier. Maybe he is Frisk. Do I just double here? Am I worried about whatever this is bigger can do? Not really. Uh, it could Draco, actually. Let's just not double, just in case. Okay. I'm sorry. Who's this? Oh, it's indeedy. Does Passimian live here? Yes, okay, cool. The Assault Vest is working. Poison? Nope. Oh, it lived! There's no way. Okay. That's unfortunate. So, okay. I'm not gonna be able to attack the Blood Moon or Saluna anymore. Because now Follow Me is in play. And I didn't bring Taunt. Do I... I think I just... I think I'm just going to sack... Um... Oh, Andrew is here. I don't know... I'm thinking he didn't bring Champau Dragonite in the back. So I don't think Landers is as needed here. Yep, there's the follow me. Hyper voice. Doesn't affect wheezing. Weakness policy, weakness policy, protect. So I could go out into Dondozo, but the problem with that is um, unaware isn't working because of my um, my neutralizing gas. So I'm gonna take full damage from this. So I'm just gonna protect oh, me. What is my item on Dondozo? Am I lefties? I think I'm lefties. I should be targeting the Blood Moon Ursula instead of the Ndidi female. That's a huge misplay on my part because if he ever swaps out or decides not to go for follow me, like right there. Earth powered into me. See, look, and that. So, Blood Moon Earth Luna should go down there, but I, um. You know. Misplayed heavily. Um. So. I mean, I just have to double into this thing. But I did make sure that Dondoza was slower than Blood Moon Earth Luna in. Trick room, so wait, then I shouldn't have protected. Yeah, what is double in the blood moon? 
Okay, they do a draw. I think Weezing's faster than Blood Moon. I know I'm not, like, negative. Okay. Perfect. That's what I was hoping for. Okay, so there goes Blood Moon. And then we've got Ndidi and the Executor left. Ndidi comes back out. So I do just want to Sludge Bomb there. And I'm going to yawn the Ndidi. Trick Room's gonna go back up. Which is fine because my. Well, Hatterene's in the back. Hatterene is the one in the back. So I think I'm gonna wanna stall out Trick Room turns. Switch Bomb into there. And then. Body press in the head. Helping hand. Executor, I believe, is faster than... Oh, it's not. Wait, how slow is Executor? Holy. 45. How am I not... Oh. Maybe I didn't make Dondozo slower. Maybe I'm throwing... And here's hat. Yep. Okay, so there's helping hand on the NDD. Really wish I had taunt, but I didn't bring it. Sludge bomb. Is yeah, it gonna do dazzling gleam? I mean, whatever it's going to do, it's going to protect. Okay. Atrabine. Protect. If he gets an early wake up here, I'm screwed. Like, if he wakes up next turn. Um, it's really bad. <laughs> I don't think this hat can Oko um, wheezing. It did wake up. That's so bad for me. Gleam. Yeah. Oh, that sucks. Okay. It's life orb. Probably magic bounce. I think I I need a stall trick room probably. It's dazzling gleam. Dazzling gleam. Standing force. Is that gonna knock me out? Yeah. Wow. Okay. So, expanding force. Okay. That's the life orb. I don't even think I figured out what the item on Executor was, but... Okay. Um... Not bad. Also, I don't know if my opponent has the same picture as me on purpose, but I don't think I've ever played them before. <laughs> so maybe we just have the same photo, unironically. So... Hmm. I want to bring Weezing... I'm gonna bring you. 
I think Fast Simeon can do a lot. I don't really like Raging Bolt here. I don't think. I think I'd much rather have Dondozo. I don't really want to bring Landris. Um, just because Landris is a... Uh, meant for the Chien Pao and Dragonite, but I'd rather just take my chance to the Chien Pao Dragonite. Yep, okay. So we're gonna see here. Does he have an ability shield? I'm just gonna wisp you and I'm gonna fake out Dragonite. See what if someone has Covert Cloak. Protect, maybe. Dragonite. And Chien Pao. Crystalizing. Chien Pao. Let's do a ghost type. Oh, Dragonite probably has inner focus. Yeah, that did too much. Throat chop. Throat chop. And Dragonite's gonna attack? Oh no, it is multi scale. Okay. Burn Chien Pao. And then also, just burn Dragonite. What would Dragonite go for? Do I want to protect here? I think the protect's kind of obvious. Is not. I feel like it's so obvious. I'll do it just in case. Yep. Weezing. Stomping into wheezing. That probably knocks me out now. Yeah. Oh wait, I don't know if it's multi scale or inner focus because I had neutralizing gas so. Sword of Ruin's gonna go up. Okay, so stomping tantrum. I knew I shouldn't have protected. I thought about that for a minute too. Bring out Pissimian here. I'm just gonna rock slide. Do I want to terrestrialize? My Terra is fire Terra. Does that help? Not really. I might as well just attack. I'll go for the... Okay, Dragonite just... S swaps DD. That's gonna allow Psychic Terrain. I don't have any... There's probably a DD hat in the back. Or, yeah, hat's probably the other one in the back. I played very predictably this game. I knew I should have attacked the last turn. Rock slide. It's gonna do some some chip. And we're gonna have Don Dozo as our final mon. I think I just wanna knock off there. And throw 
job. I'm just gonna tear it, actually. No, I don't want to Terra. You know, this yawning that yawning that slot was really dumb, but my brain is huge. I did it on purpose. Safety goggles. Magic bounce. <laughs> My brain is not huge. Okay. Um, so it's going to be... Ex probably just going to spam expanding force. So I have a turn to do something here. Um, there's no trick room up. I think I just want to Terra... Could be a double protect. I think they might just go for expanding force. I don't know if I live in expanding force. But this will make sure that I live a dazzling gleam. Now that I've yawned to myself, I'm kind of screwed there. Protect, okay. I don't remember, did I click rock slide? No, I didn't. Ice spinner into that. Okay, no more terrain. I did click rock slide. Okay, good on me. Spina. An avalanche. Okay, then there's no protect on the side of... Um, well, they could protect. They could go for the double protect. Potato boy dog. I think I just gotta go for the iron head. And then... I mean, Dondozo's useless at this point. <clears throat> Can't do anything. Except avalanche. Double into the hat. Sacred sword. Going for chip. Iron head. A flinch here would be huge for me. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Okay. Um, this might go to game three because of that flinch. I don't think I risk um, not hitting the... Yeah. I kind of figured the protector come out there, but I don't think I can risk not going for the protect or not attacking into that. Because I think I take one more, even if it's a crit. But then the question is, does Dondozo win one versus one against Champao? That I don't know. Because all Dondozo can do is click Avalanche, but Champao does have to attack. They go for the double protect. Oh, and they get it. Oh, no. Okay, hold on. Yeah. Shoot. Hey, Dondozo woke up. All right. I just gotta keep attacking into this, <laughs> into this uh, hatter in here. Triple protect, live. Oh, thank God. I think that it might have been a roll to knock out there. I'm not 100 percent sure. That keeps us alive. Avalanche. Yep, and then burn will knock it out. Right? Yep. Okay. Holy game too. Wow. Okay. Okay. That flinch saved me. That double protect was almost super clutch on his side though. 
I was like, if he gets his double protect, I might be in trouble. But then it would have came close. I don't know. Dondozo doesn't have any attack investment, so... Would have been a close one. Surprisingly, all of these games, both of these games have been very close so far, so... I'm liking that. Makes it a little bit more exciting. Okay, so let's see. So I think... I feel like I have to lead... Weezing. Because their abilities when they hit the field are a little too, too much. I think I want to lead Weezing, you, Dozo, and. Do I want to bring Bolt? I think I do. Yeah, I'm going to bring Bolt for this final game. We'll give Raging Bolt uh, some time to shine, maybe. Man, the natural defense stat on... um, What's his name? Pissimian saved me there. Okay, it's these two once more. Gonna guess so. Do I just. Do I drain punch just in case? Or do I just go for maximum damage on the tree? Because I know the tree is going for. Let's just go for maximum damage on the tree. Yeah. I kind of figured Protect would come out there. So we'll knock off Exeggutor's item. Which is probably a very covert cloak. And he gets a Trick Room. Would have loved to knock off the Ursa Luna instead. The Simeon is the fastest thing on the field, which is really unfortunate. I mean, he's just going to brick break himself again, right? I think so. I just drain punch. See if he Terra normals again. He might save his Terra for something else. I have to Terra Weezing here because I don't want Weezing going down to um, Blood Moon or Saluna because Weezing is kind of my way to deal with Blood Moon or Saluna. Helping hand. Is it going to be Earth Power? Okay, we live. We get Udar Citrus. Oh, that, that's not the right mod. Opening hand. This Exeggutor set is really interesting. I didn't even know Exeggutor got Trick Room until I saw it let off. I was like, wait a minute. Does this thing get Trick Room? So it's no more Trick Room for my opponent. They do get their um, boost from that. So he's going to have to choose here what the lead is. So I'm going to protect. What am I more afraid of? <laughs> Hold on. I think I'm more afraid of the Ursa Luna that's boosted in front of me. 
Does Hat have? Mm -hmm. I mean, there could be multiple trick rooms. So does that mean that Indeedy came in the back? Because I think my opponent ideally wants to get rid of both of my Mon or my uh, my Weezing to get Psychic Surge up. That's probably an obvious play, but I think it was my best play, and I'll probably just get doubled up into. Yeah, I think Pacimian goes down here. And then... Oh. Yeah, Pessimian's gonna go down, and unless they doubled, tried to double into Weezing. No, Hyper Voice. Okay. Um, Earth Power. My Raging Bolt is in a really bad spot. Trickman's got two more turns. I honestly think I just swap out into Dondozo here. And I'm gonna protect. Uh, this is tough. I could T Bolt. I think I just protect, because why not quick two spread moves? I should have brought wide guard. Because it's probably just going to be, what, hyper voice and... Well, no. Yeah, probably hyper voice and dazzling gleam. This is probably going to do a lot to Dondozo. It might even knock Dondozo out. Did like half. Earth power. Yeah, that's going to knock him out. I sh so I sh well, no, because attacking wouldn't have done anything for me. I think I have to just go for double protect on my Raging Bolt. And... Protect Weezing. Is that what I have to do here? Because otherwise Raging Bolt's not going to get a head off. Yeah, Raging Bolt's the fastest thing on the field. I have to go for double protect. Oh my goodness, I got it. So that is going to give me the opportunity to... Does he just protect with Ursula in the next turn, though? Good power. Okay. So now Trick Room's going to go down. Honestly, might just protect with Ursula Luna. I think I go for the Draco Meteor into that slot regardless. This is really... I have to get really lucky to win this one here. Swapping into who? Indeedy, okay. Still no Psychic Surge. Protect. It's about half. No sludge bomb. I beat this is like my only shot. Is it not? The Dazzling Gleam definitely takes me out. Ew, why is she looking at me? 
I think I gleam. Gleam protect. Pray for crits. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> or uh, destiny bomb protect. Pray for crits. Yeah. They have trick room. No. I just lose. The last move was trick room. Unfortunate. I mean, do I go for another double protect? I don't think so. I honestly don't think it really matters. I don't like that DD staring into my soul. I bet you, I wonder if had or er, uh, not Hatterene, but. In... Yeah, Hatter, no, in DD. I wonder if in DD also had Trick Room, so he had three of them. I should have brought White Guard. Damn, well, GG to my opponent. Um, I will have their channel linked in the description below, so make sure you go and check them out. And yeah, that'll do it for week what week is this week four and i'll see you guys in week five so make sure you look forward to that as this game slowly wraps up here with all the animations going off now that there's no more neutralizing gas all right i'll see y'all next week